Oh, what's good, everyone? DB Zoom back at you with a brand new video. And guys, I am surprisingly excited for this update here. Now, uh, you know, this update at first glance, it might not be too appealing to the human eye, but we can actually farm a few thousand crystals alongside a few Legends Limited Z powers. So I'm going to show you guys the whole thing, where to get them, how to get them. And as well as we're going to be talking about all these bait banners that we're currently getting with Ultra Gogeta coming back, Android 17 and 18, and what this means for August, because August, uh, the movie Dragon Ball Super Superhero comes out in uh, I believe in North America, August 19th and a few other places shortly after. So guys, we are going to uh, be discussing exactly how to get these crystals and Legend Limited Z power. So if you guys do find this video informative, make sure you guys simply like the video, subscribe if you guys haven't already because why not? It's free. So let's not waste any time, guys. Let's try to get into it. So first things first, let me clear this calculator because uh, it's a little bit of a spoilers on how much we can farm, but I'll show you exactly how we can farm that. It's actually not that hard to be honest with you. Uh, so first things first is we are going to be covering the crystals uh, for the crystals. It's pretty, um, you know, it's, it's pretty straightforward to be honest with you guys this week. So we are going to cover absolutely everything from A through Z, starting off with the weekend login bonus. If you guys log in for the weekend, you guys can collect 100 Chrono Crystals on the last day of the weekend. So let's just add on 100 really quick. All right, cool. Now we are also going to be adding uh, the daily stamps. And for the daily stamps, we can actually... Um, let me see the daily stamps. Yeah. Oh, my bad. The daily stamps. We can actually, uh, we can form a thousand with, within two weeks. So the way I like to do this and divide it is just divided by two weeks, right? 500 and 500. Because some of you guys might not be on the same pace as others. You guys might, you know, skip a, skip a day and your guys' stamp cards might be ruined. So uh, me and you might not be on the same page. So let's just divide it 500 per week. So let's just add on 500 on top of what we had before. And we are at 600 chrono crystals guys now we did just get a brand new co-op which is very interesting and we'll we'll touch a little bit of details in this co-op here because we can actually form a legends limited z power within this co-op and i'll show you the best way to do that as well in just one bit now uh for this co-op we can form 606 uh, the 606 easily just comes from all the uh, first time rewards the measly crystals on the side um a few um i, I believe uh, throughout the shop we can collect um i think 300 uh which are dual coins so uh if we just scroll down let me just show you guys it should have gone reset yeah 300 here so let's just book in 606 on top of what we had before all right guys so we are at 12,006 crystals uh fairly solid but we are not even close to being done uh next up we do have the brand new majin boo event actually I take that back. It's it's still the same event, but we got the hard mode and it's just kind of weird to see the whole event empty. I kind of like it to be honest with you guys. It was so overwhelming with all these like returning events. It was so annoying to me personally. My OCD definitely kicked in. So, uh, but here, you know, I did all the calculations, all these little missions in between the first time rewards, all that good stuff. Here we can collect 350 crystals. So let's book in 350 crystals. All right, guys, so we're at 1,556. Next up, we do have a brand new story mode, which I did finish and I did the calculations for you guys already, uh, which is a brand new part 13, which is interesting, right? Uh, so we got a brand new part 13, book one. Um, so yeah, here we can, it's not too much, but uh, if you guys also include all the crystals in between, the first time rewards and the first time rewards you, uh, you can collect from your missions, that's gonna be 300 and 46 crystals guys so let's add on 346 on top of what we had before and we are at 1902 so you guys are wondering where the second half of all the crystals comes from that's going to be coming from the missions in specific now i didn't collect my rewards just to show you guys really quick um first and foremost a thousand from this majin boo uh, event here which is very simple just go there clear all the missions and you guys can collect 1000 and you guys can zenkai your skinny evil boo which i plan on doing a showcase for you guys tomorrow as soon as i soul boost or i think i did soul boost them yeah i did so I i'll just schedule that for you guys tomorrow as well uh, so that's a thousand crystals on top of what we had before so let's add this on all right, guys, so we are at 2,902 crystals. So let's collect this really quick. And uh, next up, we am, I only collected 300 off of that because I already collected some of it uh, some of it in between. So um, yeah, we're at 26.8 crystals. And we're going to be getting to the banners in just one bit as well. Um, so next up, we also do have 100 from the Summer Adventures. So let's add on 100 on top of what we had before. All right, guys, so we are at 3,002 crystals, and the final 1,000 actually is going to come from, I believe, where is it? Did I collect it? 
where's the where's the man uh i think oh yeah for, right here i already collected so 1000 from here uh this the, the way you guys can collect these um basically a uh, legend summer uh, uh summer uh, carnival medals is pretty much by doing co-op and logging in and just itty bitty stuff like that you guys aren't you guys can farm this really quick with co-op um and i'll get to co-op in just one bit as well so let's add on 1000 on top of what we had before all right cool guys that is a total of 4002 crystals now we are going to be getting onto the legends limited z power very very simple stuff uh it's connected to the co-op as you guys can see here with uh the summer boot camp uh returns and if you guys just go to your boot camp medals uh right here you guys can actually um speed up the process of these medals and i'll show you guys in just one bit but here we can collect 200 legends uh limited multi z power so very excited for this um the fact that they're just dishing out legends limited multi z power more often i love that um i plan on using this on my mui goku or my 18 and 17 17 and 18 so um that's still for debate i don't know exactly what i'm going to be doing but yeah guys some really great rewards some zenkai souls here as well um and you guys can collect a lot of stuff so i'm definitely going to farm this very hardcore uh to collect absolutely everything on my time off so um yeah guys that's pretty much oh yeah let me just show you really quick on the co-op side so the co-op side it's very simple guys uh, just use uh, the the battle bonus uh, or the bonus character teams. So just use all these free to play characters right here. You guys can see. Just go to uh, the drop down here, and you guys can clearly see. And as for the Buhan and Tian, they come out next weekly reset, um, which is going to be one day before the uh, this current All Star banner ends, which uh, which is uh, Whis and Golden Freezes. So. Yeah, guys, um, you know, this update is quite interesting because we're getting a lot of bait banners. We just got Ultra Super uh, Gogeta coming back once again, which is crazy, right? He, I feel like he's coming back every three weeks or something like that. So, uh, he's came back quite a few times now within these next few months, within these last few months. Uh, and then as well as 18 and 17, and we got this banner guaranteed, um, Legends Limited Unit coming back. So, what's the deal with all this what is the deal with all this now my speculation is that they're going to collaborate with dragon ball super superhero august uh like august 20th something and excuse that motorcycle in the back trying to look cool but august 20th or something like that so i i think they're going to do what they did with full power jiren and mui goku i think they're going to separate orange pickle and gohan beast in two separate banners I believe Orange Pickle is going to be included on the August banner. And then for Legends Festival for Black Friday, uh, we're going to be getting Gohan Beast. That is my speculation as of today. Take that with a grain of salt. Uh, we're also getting a whole bunch of region buffs, including a uh, unique, not a unique equipment, a uh, awakened equipment for Namekians. So very interesting stuff, guys. And uh, am I going to summon all this? Maybe just for fun. I don't know, man. Uh, I know the, the next banner comes out tomorrow, or not tomorrow, next week, so the TN banner, which I'm very excited for TN, more than Buhan actually, surprisingly, uh, which we're going to get to in the in the video tonight, in a few hours from now, I'll break that down with uh, with some more details, so yeah guys, that's going to wrap it up, 4,200 crystals, 200 Legends Limited Multi Z Power is quite good if you guys ask me, so uh, if you guys did enjoy the video, found it informative, make sure you guys simply like the video, Subscribe if you guys haven't already. Turn on those notifications because I'm going to be coming out with another video in a few hours from now and as well as tomorrow. So I'll definitely catch you guys once again later on tonight. Have a good one. Peace.